Okay, here's the next question. This was posted by Rinsi. Partnership? Yeah, this is on partnership. See what Rinsi says. Murli and Manohar start a business together by investing rupees 40,000 and 50,000. Joshi joins them after a certain number of months, investing rupees 60,000 in the venture. Everything goes well till Manohar decides to quit before the exactly same number of months as Joshi had joined the business after. If at the end of the year they share their profits in the ratio of 16 is to 15 is to 18, find the number of months given the reference. Okay, so partnership, but not something which is commonly asked, right? Interesting question. He says, Man Murli and Manohar have started the business by investing 40k and 50k. Joshi joins after some months. The business was absolutely fine, but Manohar leaves at one point and he leaves exactly the same number of months before as the number of months after which Joshi had joined the business. And based on that, their profit share comes out to be in the ratio of 16 is to 15 is to 18. So find the number of months given in the reference. You have maybe one minute to this. try this. Your time starts now. All right, the question goes as follows. Murli and Manohar start a business together by investing rupees 40,000 and rupees 50,000. Joshi joins them after a certain number of months investing rupees 60,000 in the venture. Everything goes well till Manohar decides to quit before the exactly same number of months as Joshi had joined the business after. If at the end of the year, they share their profits in the ratio of 16 is to 15 is to 18, find the number of months given in the reference. Find the number of months given in the reference. So basically a partnership question where we have three partners, Murli, Manohar and Joshi. Murli has invested 40K. Manohar has invested 50k and Joshi has invested 60k, right? Now he says Joshi joins them after a certain number of months, right? After a certain number of months. So let's assume the number of months after which Murli uh, Joshi joins is x, right? Joshi joined them after x months. Now everything goes well till Manohar decides to quit before the exactly same number of months as Joshi had joined the business after. So basically Joshi has joined in the middle, Manohar has left in the middle. Now, Manohar has left exactly the same number of months before as Joshi had joined after the number of months. You getting it? So, if Joshi had joined after X months, Manohar leaves before X months. Manohar decides to quit before. So, this before the exactly same number of months. You know, this exactly same number of months referred to X. So, Manohar decides to quit before X months as Joshi had joined the business after after X months. Now, at the end of the year, so he is referring to 12 months here, right? At the end of the year, they share their profits in the ratio of 16 is to 15 is to 18. Find the number of months given the reference. So, what is the number of months is the question. Simple. You see this profit ratio, Murli is to Manohar is to Joshi. How do you divide profit? Profit is proportional to investment into time of investment. So, Murli's investment is 40k for 12 months. How about Manohar? See, Manohar has invested 50k, but Manohar leaves the business before X months. Manohar quits the business before X months. So out of 12 months, he was not there for X months. So 12 minus X months is to Joshi. Joshi has invested 60K. Now Joshi joins the business after X months, which means Joshi was not there in the business for X months. You're able to follow. So if, if you look at the timeline from zero months to 12 months, this is zero months, let's say, and this is 12 months. These X months and these X months. So it's like Manohar quits. Manohar quits at this point. So he was not there in the business for X months. So 12 minus X. You're able to follow. And this this refers to what? Joshi is joining. Joshi joins. Joshi joins after X months. So he was not there for this span. Manohar was not there for this span. So both are 12 minus X, right? So 14 to 12 is to 15 to 12 minus X is to 16 to 12 minus X, right? Zeros anyway get cancelled here. And this ratio is equal to what? 16 is to 15 is to 18, right? So finally, what we get is 4 into 12, 48 is to 5 into 12, 60 minus 5x is to 6 into 12, 72 minus 6x is equal to 16 is to 15 is to 18. Now simplify for x, you know, you can just take one part of here, 48 by 60 minus 5x equals to 16 by 15. This goes three times. 3 15s is 45. So 45 is 60 minus 5x. So 5x is equal to uh, 15. X will come out to be 3. X comes out to be 3. Right? 
So three months is the final answer, right? So the number of months given in the reference is three months. 